Good evening from the not East Eddie Wall. I'm here with Carl at the Carl Genuine Man of Genius compound again, and he has got something that is absolutely cool. This is an integrally suppressed Ruger 7722 All Weather. Go ahead and tell them about it. Okay, this one came from a fella down in Alabama. It's called Rock Creek Gun Service, and this thing is probably one of the quietest suppressors I've ever heard. It, it it sounds like an air rifle. It's uh, absolutely beautiful. All right. Fairly inexpensive. Uh, give him a call. Good guy to work with. All right. If you want to try it out? Yeah, we'll go ahead and I'll pop off a couple, and then we'll let you pop off a couple. Man, that is just very nice. When he handed it to me, I thought it was a bull barrel, and I saw those perforations <laughs> right there in the end of the barrel, and I realized this thing was integrally suppressed. This is just regular old 22 ammo. Yeah, CCI standard velocity. All right, got one loaded up, ready to go. Getting a little dark for these dark shades, but I should be able to do all right. Ah, oh, that's so quiet. Now here's one just going straight into the dirt. Ah, you can't <laughs> believe how quiet that is. Go one with the steel, and I'm gonna hand it back off to Carl. <laughs> I love it. All there right. you go. Got her opened up. Yep. Now give me just a second to make sure you're in frame. There you go. All right. All right. Here's one on the steel. Ah! So quiet, man. And we'll fire one up in the dirt. another one in the dirt see what she sounds like sound like you're throwing rocks man mm-hmm you want to fire one more I got, I got yeah. another one or two in it yeah let me go ahead we'll shoot it till she's done that is crazy quiet I've shot 22 suppressed I've got silencers at home but this right here the fact that we're just 16 inches and there's no wart hanging off the end of it that is actually so cool. it's 18 oh 18 inches yeah it's an 18 inch barrel all right well i stand corrected actually inside the barrel is 12 and a half inches and then the rest of the tube it's actually this from about here back is all a big blast baffle so that's the one of the secrets of why it's so quiet that is so cool boy old carl dragged out another one tell him about it Okay, this is a Savage Mark II. It's got the fluted threaded barrel on it. And on the end of it, we've got a Rebel Silencer SOS 22. I don't know if you can see the segments on here, but you can actually shorten this down a little bit, or you can run it full length. Ah, cool. Okay, uh, these guys are out of Texas and super cool to work with. I've got several of their silencers, and we'll be trying them out at some point, won't we, Pat? Absolutely. As long as you got a good phone and a camera, we can do it, right? Yep, yep we'll okay. do it. Okay. Well, let's see how it works, man. All right. Give her a whirl. Well, that scope is picking up well in this low light. Yep. Oh, so quiet. And that weighted handle, I mm -hmm. like that. Yep. Put one in the dirt. I heard a limb. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. Yeah, well, I'm going to leave this one open. It's ready for you to set them. There we go. That was Carl just keeps dragging out cool stuff. Go ahead and tell them about this little 1022 here, bud. Okay. This is a standard Ruger 1022, and it's got a Boyd's nice stock on it. And... This is a Gemtech Mist 22 integrated barrel for it. Um, not quite as quiet as that 1722, but it's it's got a cool factor. You don't have to keep jacking them in by hand. It's a semi-auto. Yeah, and this is just standard lead nose CCI standard velocity stuff. Yep, I buy that stuff by the brick. That's the best ammo made. All right, well, I'm just going to send some into the dirt. 
we'll see how quiet this one is. Ah, love how quiet that is. Here, not not you... as quiet as the Ruger, but <laughs> quiet enough. Right. Almost too dark for that scope right now. Yep. Hey, whenever you're over here at uh, Carl's house, there's no telling what comes out of the safe. All right. <laughs> well, big thank you to Carl for showing this off. This is just absolutely cool. Well, thank you for watching and have a wonderful day. All right. So, Austin and I, we go to the store, we get some chicken wings. We get everything and we walk outside. It looks like it's about to start raining. And he says, Dad, all we got to do, we can still cook in the rain. We just put a tent over it. I looked at him. He looked back at me. And he said, that would be some intense cooking. I was just like, crap, son. <laughs>